Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. Oh, I definitely will. <laughs> you okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but... It just hasn't felt this... this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This yeah, house ain't sure. worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. Clem. Just be careful. Why would I need to be careful? Something something's gonna happen? she have to say I know she was running her mouth what did she say you shouldn't have done that to Arvo I know I know Clem but, but Luke... I don't care you can't do that Jesus Clem you know me you know I'm not like that you scared me you scared all of us Kenny it won't happen again that's a promise over but AJ needs us now we got to stick together on this thing all right come on let's see if the truck's gonna go I can bet it's gonna work maybe we need some new batteries or Rex he was fixing up he was a mean some bitch but he taught me respect girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee at first. Of course, he helped me in mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. All right. Hopefully it's not, it's not gonna. Come on. Nope. It's not gonna attract We're walkers. So close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than. Snow and goddamn Euro trash. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? I've never been there. I went once, long time ago, just before I met Ken. All right, turn it again. All right. And close. Did you turn it? Yes. 
God damn it! <sighs> Have you ever wondered if there is gasoline in it? <laughs> we'll get it working. We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Oh, who's this? Bonnie. Can I go up? Nope. Hey, what is this? Oh, I, I can't. I can't see it now. Looks like it's about to collapse. Toolbox. Oh, a generator. Looks broken. Can we fix it? Busted. Oh, damn it. Guess we don't have the proper tools. This episode is amazing so far. Hopefully it's going to be longer than the last one. Because the last one just flew by. I didn't even feel it. Want one? <laughs> oh, no. No, thanks. Do you remember when you saw me first? Back at the lodge? Check her for weapons. I liked you from the start. You ever done something you regret? Even if it's something you knew you had to do. Of course, killing Lee. Go on. I wish I'd never looked for my parents. Because Dad got you Lee know, killed. I'll say one thing about Luke. No matter where you end up, there's always one bad seed rocking the boat. But I don't think he would have ever been that guy. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? Oh, hell, I can't even remember. I don't really know what I want. Maybe I ought to start thinking about it. You know, I've been all over. Run with a lot of people. A lot of men. And listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way, you know? I'm gonna go take a piss. I guess I gotta go back. I wonder if I could just stay out and help Kenny with, but I guess there wouldn't be any options available. Dialogue options, I mean. Hey. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! <laughs> Seen that look before. Son of a bitch. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. What? I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth.
Looks like she's giving me a kin for future episodes. <laughs> Seems like you've done that before. It's not rocket science. I feel like I'd drop it. Okay, I'm in charge of the baby holding. Yeah, that's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm feeling when I'm holding my godfather's baby. <laughs> it's so small and just. I don't, I'm, af left. I'm afraid of holding it. I was running it. with some people a long time ago down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. And they all died. Lost four people before we got him out. Oh. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... Oh, the truck. Was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. There we go. He got it working. Works? What I tell you. So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. Let's just get out of the snow. I'm all for that. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The fuck? It was oh, just no. an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. We don't have to leave right now. Let's just sleep on it. Well, that sounds sensible. Damn it, we don't have time. Says you. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. Better him than another one of us. We have to bring him with us. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got loot killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? Oh, yeah. How could I forget? God damn it! You can't just walk away from us. Better talk some sense into him. For his sake. I really don't know where to go. South or north? Huh. God damn it. God damn it! That stupid fucking. Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry, just give me a second. Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. 
I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. They're scared of you, Kenny. Well, if their big plan is to wander around in the woods, they ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. This is different. How? Where are we gonna find baby formula? I don't know, but sitting around here ain't a way. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. What you think he'd say? To keep the group together. I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit. But where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. Uh, I felt pride, a pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him, you and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Let's get some sleep, cause we gotta be ready. Hopefully, the truck's gonna get stolen or something. 